Hi guys, welcome back to some Bubuletza. I'm trying to keep this short because I like these three minute, four minute long videos. I hope you guys like them too. Anyway, I wanted to show you a quick and easy way to apply foundation with a really good coverage. I actually have a couple blemishes as you'll see in the uh, further along in the video. But I wanted to show you guys um, how I quickly apply foundation, highlighter, and contour. Ready for ah face. <laughs> During the summer, there are two products that I like to use. This L'Oreal BB Cream for Light Coverage Days and this Revlon Color Stay Foundation if I need a fuller coverage for my blemishes and freckles. Depending on my coverage, I like to use a dampened beauty blender sponge for an airbrushed finish, but if my foundation is a little thicker, I'll buff it in using this dense Real Techniques brush. However, if I'm in a hurry to get out the door, I'll use this large Becca brush which is great for a fast and easy application. So I'm not being sponsored for any of the brands used in this video, I just really, really like them. To start out, I like to use the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer on my face. I put moisturizer on a few minutes prior. And I only apply this primer to anywhere there is a natural crease, like under my eyes, around my nose, and also my mouth. I take an itty bitty amount of primer and warm it up between my fingers and you want to avoid using too much primer otherwise your foundation will actually slide off later in the day. To cover up my little blemishes, I use a really thick foundation from Yabby and I pat it on over the top and blend it out. To make this stay in place all day, I apply my NARS translucent powder over the top using a sponge. Now for the foundation application. I decided to use my BB cream because it's a little bit lighter and I applied it to the back of my hand to break down the pigment first. And then using my Becca brush, I swept the foundation back and forth and in circular motions to blend it out on my face. For a better blend, I sprayed Max Fix Plus on the brush and buffered the foundation in for a more dewy finish. Now for some contouring. I think this is Latte for a Makeup Geek with the same Becca brush and chiseling out my cheekbones. For the highlight, I'm using the champagne color from NYX over the tops of my cheeks and also along my nose in the cupid's bow of my lips. And we're finished! And that's my quick and easy way to get almost flawless foundation for summer and spring without wearing full coverage. So if you enjoy this video, please give it a little thumbs up. If you like it, please subscribe. Anyway, I love you guys. Take care and stay electric as always. Bye.